Hey, it's your art teacher, Jessica Antonelli, and I've been getting some requests for an introduction on how to get started in this month's drawing challenge, October's Drawing Architecture and Environments. So I'm going to go ahead and show you exactly what to do if you would like to join our awesome group over at learn.10stepstodrawing.com. So this is my free art school, and it's a really fun place where you get to join our monthly drawing challenges. And if you're not into the one we're doing this month, you can always do the one from the month before. You can also take one of my free classes, like from stick figures to savvy sketches. So maybe you're not ready for architecture environments yet, but you want to do stick figures <laughs> and to make them even better. And there's just so many other cool things that I'm posting in the group. It's really your online art studio where you'll be able to privately practice, get feedback from me on everything you draw, and have other artists that are out there support you. It's always so cool how everybody in the group's cheering each other on. So it's a fun place to hang out. What you'll do is get started with the free membership. You can sign in using your name or Facebook and click that little plus sign to add a picture of yourself. Okay, so once you log in, you'll be asked to pay nothing. It is free. Go ahead and confirm that purchase. And you're in. So when you get started, you'll see a big start here button, which is great for just a general overview of how everything works inside our learn.10stepstodrawing.com community. Um, however, if you're specifically looking to get started with the monthly challenge, what you're going to do is come over here to the topics section. And if you want to start with the architecture and environment challenge, go ahead and click that topic. Now, this is where you're going to see each and every post that has anything to do with this topic. We've got other people who've been um, starting their challenges. But what I'm going to have you look for is this architecture and environment drawing challenge video. Here, you'll get the replay of a video that we film on a live call every Tuesday um, to kick off the week's challenge. So Tuesday nights at 7 p.m. Central, you can either jump in on this live call or you can catch the replay. So in the video, I go over all of the homework and I also step-by-step -step do a drawing lesson that will help you be successful in our drawing challenge. And what is the challenge? Every week, what I'm asking you to do is draw 30 minutes a day for five days a week. So that's two and a half hours total of drawing. And ideally, you're getting a little bit in almost every day, five days a week. Amazing. But um, if you have to cram it all in together, if you're getting in two and a half hours of drawing a week, you are going to see huge differences in your artwork. I do want to show you real quick one other way to get to this video if that seems like too complicated. You can go over to the sidebar and click discovery. Here you're going to see all kinds of fun stuff to discover, popular posts, other people who might be near you. And if you scroll down, you'll also see the featured section. Now this is where I post any of the important information about the monthly drawing challenges. So you see that video replay again is the most recent thing that's been posted. You'll see the overview and the homework, which I'm going to show you in just a second. And then if you keep scrolling sideways, you'll see all of last month's September drawing challenge and the elements of art drawing challenge that was the month before that, both the videos and the drawing assignments. So what does a drawing assignment look like? Let's check it out. For this particular week, for week one of architecture and environments, we're jumping into perspective, composition, trees, all kinds of fun stuff. And if you scroll down at the bottom of each week overview, just simple picture, you can download the actual drawing packet guide. And if you click that here, you'll see day by day exactly what you'll be drawing. So this month, we're jumping into both the landscape part of environments and also the a little more technical 
perspective bits in drawing environments. So here you have it. You can check that all out in the video. I'll really spell it all out for you and give you a great idea of exactly what your expectations are. Now let's say you've downloaded the PDF, you've done your homework, you watch the video, you know exactly what's up. How do you post your artwork? Well, let's go and click home and go back to the home page. And would you look at that? There's like a little gray circle that's throbbing over here. If I click that, first of all, it's gonna give me a little tour, that's handy. But that is how you can add a post. So you can click quick post, or if you don't wanna click this button here, you could also click where it says share what's on your mind. Click that plus and you'll need to take a photograph of the artwork that you just drew. So you can also download this whole community, this membership community as an app on your phone, which I find really easy. That way you don't have to take a picture on your phone, send it to your computer, but I'll talk about that in a minute. Let's just say you've already got your picture of your drawing homework. You're gonna go ahead and upload that photo and please share a little bit of whatever your process was. Please go ahead and share a little bit of what was going through your mind maybe whenever you were doing the drawing. Was it easy, difficult? I'm actually, um, if you haven't noticed already, wounded. I broke my right hand this month. So I've been drawing with my left hand this month. Add another layer to the challenge. Um, and so my latest post, I was just writing about how it's really hard to draw with your non-dominant hand. So anything like that would be helpful. Then once you're ready to post and you've written a little note about your experience drawing, click this little button here that says add topic. You're going to go to architecture and environments, and then you're going to click post. And then your post will appear here in our feed of all of the artwork that everybody's doing. So. That is a basic play-by-play -play of how you can join this month's October Drawing Challenge. It's not too late. You can join either today or within the next uh, week, I would say, by October 14th. It's probably our cutoff date. So I hope you can make it. Please come and draw with us. Creativity is so good for you. And it'll be a lot of fun. So hopefully I'll see you in the membership group. Let me know if you have questions. Ciao for now.